guys! Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Humor PH. And ito na naman ang pabibo ninyong guro na punong-puno ng humor and willing to give you more. Narito ako para tulungan ka na tulungan ang sarili mong matuto sa pamamagitan ng math pinadali, math pinasaya, at math pinaexcite mo ng mathematics lessons. Ngayong araw naman pag-uusapan natin ang tungkol sa complement of assets. Wala itong pinagkaiba doon sa lesson natin kahapon which is the difference of two sets. And, wag na nating patagalin ulit. Let's get to our lesson in 3, 2, 1, go! Hi, good day everyone. I hope you're doing good. Ngayong araw, pag-uusapan naman natin ngayon ng about sa complement of a set. Just like what we did in the previous lessons about set, I'm just going to present to you two examples and what you're going to do is to observe kung ano nga ba yung pattern na pwede mong makita doon sa naging sagot natin. Ngayon, makikisama na sa atin si universal set. Letter U Once na nakita mong letter U ang pangalan ng set, that means the, that is the universal set. Ibig sabihin ng universal set, lahat ng possible elements nasa kanya. Ayan. Set A is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Set B, 0, 4, 8, and 12. Again, lahat na nang dito sa ibaba niya, nandun yan lahat kay universal set. Mas malawak, mas malaki si universal set compared sa mga set na under niya. Alright. So, for example, number one. Ayan. Let's A complement or complement of A kapag pin pinabasa. Ito po, symbol yan for complement. Once you are solving for the A complement, the answer would become like this. 0, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. For example, number two. B complement or complement of B. Ayan. The answer would be 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 7, 9, 10, and 11. So now, it's your turn. I'll give you one minute to observe and I'll get back to you right away. Your one minute starts now. Alright, that's enough. So let's have now the following. What happened? Ano nangyari? Kap ano nangyari kapag kinukuha si A complement? Saan to nang galing? Yes, galing yan lahat sa universal set. Hindi yan pwede mang galing kay B. Kasi si B wala namang 9. Si B wala namang 10. Pero lahat ng ito nandun sa universal set. Tama. Pero, nawala yung 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Ayun. So, ganun ang ginagawa kay complement. Ibig sabihin, okay, observe natin muna si B. Eto, galing saan? Yes, universal set din ulit. Galing yan dito kay universal set. And, nawala yung 0, 4, 8, and 12. The idea there is just like idea natin ng difference of set. So, eto ang nangyayari. Kinukuha lahat ng elements na nasa universal. Ibig sabihin, kapag complement ang magkalaban, yung set na given sa ka-universal lang. 
pero tinatanggal lahat ng elements ng given set. Let's take this one. Lahat ng nandito sa A, kailangan mawala. Tapos ang sisulat mo, lahat ng nasa universal. Ayan. Tanggalin mo si 1, tanggalin mo si 2, si 3, si 4, si 5, or i-minus mo yung lahat. Ang matitira, sa universal siya ang sagot. Ayan yung 0, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And just like letter B, tanggalin mo si 4. Sa so, ang unang element, ay tanggalin mo si 0. Unang element ay 1, 2, 3. Tanggalin mo si 4. 5, 6, 7. Tanggalin mo si 8. 9, 10, 11. Tanggalin mo si 12. So, ganito lang ang idea ng complement of a set. Ayan, parang siyang, yung A complement, universal minus set A. Universal set minus set A. So, kukunin mo lahat ng element ng universal, imaminus mo lang yung pareho doon sa A. Ang B complement naman, lahat ng elements ng universal minus yung pareho sa B. Ganun lang siya kinagawa. And, the order should always be ascending, then, no repetition of elements, dapat. To further understand, I'll give you another two examples. I define muna natin. Sorry. So, by definition, ang ibig sabihin ng complement of a set, ito yung pinagsama-samang element or elements ng universal set na wala sa given set. Ascending order dapat, or pataas, and no repetition of elements. Ganun lang. Kapag A complement, etong dalawa ang consider natin. Kapag B complement, B sa ka universal ang gagamitin natin. Let's have another example. We have the given universal set. Ito yun. C, we have elements of 1, 4, 16, 64, set B, 1, 9, 36, 81. For example, number 3, we're tasked to solve complement of C or C complement. Ibig sabihin, kung si C ang pinag-uusapan, tatanggalin mo si B. Kasi ang kakailangan natin ay universal at saka yung C. Lahat ng nasa C tatanggalin. Ayan. May 1 doon, tanggal. May 4, tanggal. 16, tanggal. 64, tanggal. Ngayon, tatanggalin natin si C kasi wala na siyang natira dyan. Lahat ng naka-universal, yun yung magiging sagot. So, kapag sinabing C complement, the answer would be, ato, 9, 25, 36, 49, 81, and 100. And that is already arranged in ascending order. Ayan. So, 9, 25, 36, 49, 81, 100, that would be for C complement. Let's have example number 4. For example number 4, B complement. Ayan. Hello, sorry. Buren ko lang. Ayan. So, D complement, hindi natin kailangan ngayon si C. Ang kailangan natin ngayon ay C, U, saka C, D. Tatanggalin mo lahat ng nasa D. Yung 1 dito, tanggalin mo din sa 1 sa universal. Yung 9 dito, tanggalin mo din doon sa 9 sa universal. Yung 36 dito, tanggalin mo din doon sa universal. 81, tanggal, 81, tanggal. Then, burahin mo si D. Then, whatever elements na matira ka universal, that would be the answer. So, for D complement, for 4, 16, 25, 49, 64, and 100, ang magiging sagot. Ayan. So, that's how you do the complement of a set. Again, let me conclude. Kapag sinabing complement of a set, lahat ng elements ng universal set na dapat wala doon sa given set. And dapat ascending order at dapat no repetition of elements tayo. Okay, I guess you're ready now for our humor drill. These are the given. Universal set, we have 5, 10, 15, 20, 10, 5, 30, 35, 40. Set A, 5, 20, 35. Set B, 10, 20, 30, 40. Set C, 5, 15, 25, and 35. So what you're going to answer are 
numbers 1 to 3, A complement, B complement, and C complement. I pause for 1 minute. If you still need time, feel free to pause it for longer, uh, for 3 to 5 minutes, kung kaya. Then, I'll get back to you right away. So, your timer starts now. Alright, that's enough. So let's answer A complement. So for A complement, hindi mo kailangan si B, hindi mo kailangan si C. Kailangan lang natin is si A sa kasi universal set. Tanggalin lahat ng nasa A. 5 tanggal, 20 tanggal, 35 tanggal. Borahin si A. Whatever na elements na tinaka universal set, that will be the answer. So, that's 10, 15, 25, 30, and 40. 10, 15, 25, 30, and 40. I hope you got it correctly. Congratulations if you did, uh, if you got it correctly. Next, B complement. For B complement, tanggalin mo si A, tanggalin mo si C. Kasi B and universal set lang ang pag-uusapan natin. Tanggal yung 10. Tanggal yung 20. Tanggal yung 30. And tanggal yung 40. So, whatever na matira ka universal set, siya yung magiging sagot sa B complement. So, that's 50, ay 5, 15, 25, 35. Ayan. Okay. Let's go to C complement. Hindi kailangan si A, hindi kailangan si B. Si C complement, tanggalin mo lahat ng kapareho sa universal. 15, tanggal. 5, tanggal. 25, tanggal. 35, tanggal. Burahin mo na rin si C. Whatever it is na matira ka universal set, yun maging sagot. 10, 20, 30, and 40. So, C complement is equal to 10, 20, 30, and 40. Alright, so I hope you got it correctly. Congratulations if you did well. And kung may mali, I'm sure you have learned something and you have learned how to do it properly. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in our next video. Sana mas marami ka pa matutunan with this. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed the video and you were able to learn something today. And please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell para updated ka sa mga latest videos na i-upload natin dito sa Humor PH. And I just want to say thank you doon sa mga subscribers na natin ng ikaw na magsusubscribe pa lang. Please click subscribe uh, down below and click the notification bell because I know that you deserve more and you can learn more and you can be more. Hashtag Humor PH. Bye-bye! See you in my next video.